Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Tiffany and today's video we are going to be doing a no eyeshadow beat, okay? I have no shadow on and my face is that. So that is going to be a focus. We're going to get into the beat down, okay? Um, if this is your first time clicking on our videos or seeing my face, welcome. Hit the subscribe button before we jump into the video. If this is not your first time here and you're just back to watch me some more exes, how you doing? How you doing? Um, the girls are out today. She has a regular bra. Normally, I'm not gonna lie, I wear a sports bra 90% of the time if I'm wearing any. But she got on a regular bra and it kind of like, hello. Um, but I'm super excited about today's video. I got a lot of compliments on how my makeup looked when we went on a little vacation, vacation anniversary vacation type deal, and I posted my face. And I got a lot of compliments. I have more blush on right now than I did then, but this, that's, that's just, that's. that's just happens you know I, it just happened i don't know why it just did all right so yeah without further ado let's just jump right into the video we are just doing a face today like base obviously the eyes are on the face so i don't know why i said that like because that's weird i'm gonna get it together so i'm gonna be using this it works radiance serum it has hyaluronic acid just gonna put a little bit over a lot yeah, nothing came out on this side. Okay. Doesn't matter. We're going to keep it moving. The serum is really good. And then for primer, I'm going to be taking the e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. I was going to take my Hydro Grip, but I've been using it in all of my videos. So I was like, let me not. And just say that I did. If you guys hear my children... They're screaming, like always. They're not crying, they're just screaming because they're insane. Okay, so I'm gonna do foundation first because I'm gonna do my brows after my foundation so I can do my concealer and all that. So we're gonna do foundation first. I'm gonna, should I take this foundation? I mean, I'm not going nowhere, so it doesn't really matter. I will take this foundation because I haven't used it in a while. It's the Hourglass Vanish Foundation and this is in the shade Sable. This is the same color I have in the Vanish Stick. So I'm just going to take this because I haven't used it in a while. I don't even remember how much I like need to use or was like recommended to use, but I'm just going to go with it. I haven't used this in a while. I do remember I had this like distinct smell and it definitely does. Well, it looks really good though. I might need to take a little bit more in a little bit, but I'm going to go off camera and do my brows and then I'll be back. Brows are done. They're looking really good. I use my Precisely Matte Brow in shade 3.5. I think I told you guys that's a new shade for me and I love it. It's perfect. It works with every hair color. Every one. I'm going to use my Fenty Concealer in 410. I feel like I shouldn't be using it this much because then I'm going to be sad when I run out again. And then I'll come back and contour my nose with that once I'm finished blending everything out. So I'm going to blend out my concealer first because I've been liking how that looks doing the concealer before the contour. So that way I can blend the contour up into the concealer and not the other way around. Okay, now that's blended out. Looks good. I'm going to go ahead and blend out my contour my foundation is back i decided i was going to film this video i didn't film my intro yet so since i'm saying this now i probably won't reiterate in the intro but if i do i'm sorry if this is your second time here let's guys um i decided to film this video because i got a lot of compliments on my makeup when we had went home and i was posting pictures from our little vacation staycation anniversary vacation and I didn't do any eyeshadow. I didn't even pack any eyeshadow on that trip. I just packed my base products and then I used my base products if I had anything on my eyes, on my eyes. So it was basically like an everyday beat, but like beat, you know? And it did look really good, I'm not gonna lie. I kinda 
she kind of snapped when she did it. And even when I was doing it, I was like, oh, look at the material. Look at the material. Just look at, look at it. It's amazing. So yeah, I was like, let me film how I did the, that look. Cause I literally didn't do my makeup, I did it the same way. So the only difference now is I did my foundation first. I did the concealer and contour first with those looks while I was at home. But this is still basically the same way I did it. Just those two steps are flipped around. So that is pretty good, blend it out. I'm gonna go back over this part with my sponge so my contour is not like all the way up like it's up but like not all the way up i'm gonna go over the bottom with the side that i had the foundation on so this is all blended oh i look at the snatchness of it all look at it and i am gonna go with a lighter concealer if i can locate it i moved all my stuff around oh I moved all my stuff around like I was saying and all of my concealers and stuff are in here. Wow, why was this concealer down there? I don't even know. So I'm going to take this Huda Beauty peanut butter concealer. Y'all know this is pretty light. It's a good little light. But she's also matte. Okay, so this dries down and she cuts up a little bit. So we're going to put her down. And we're going to immediately dry her out. A lot of people don't like this applicator on the Huda Concealer. I'm not really sure why. It's like metal. I don't feel like it's metal. But it's like, it's a cooling applicator. So like it cools, you know, your skin. When you put it on, it feels amazing to me. I love the applicator on that concealer. So I'm not really sure why some people don't like it, but it's just not their cup of tea. But you know, to each his own. You can't you can't please everybody. I'm taking the concealer around on my eye. So everything is everything. Especially because I'm not really doing any I mean I put concealer on my eye anyway, like to prep for my shadows, but I'm not doing any shadows, so I really just want everything to be cohesive. And back around on this side with the contour brush. Excuse me. Like, who is she? She is that check. I had to get my powder, so I had to reach down and find it. So I'm gonna use this Huda Easy Bake Powder. That's what it's called. Yeah, Easy Bake Loose Baking and Setting Powder. And I have the shade Banana Braid powder though can get real in your face so you want to make sure you tread very lightly with this powder so i'm going to put some on the sponge tap some off in the cap Ooh, she creasing already Okay, this sponge sucks. That sponge I got in my boxy charm like a couple months ago. It sucks. I used it once, never looked back, and now I'm seeing why, because it's trash. Okay, so I'm just gonna keep it moving. Set in the lid. Let's look at the freaking material. Okay, don't forget, I still have to go over and do a little nose snatch situation. I'm going to take this crease brush, take the tip of it. Okay. 
Okay, just do that. It'll be a lot easier. Look at that. Okay, if you see some little dusty rugrats running around behind me, it's my children. I let them out their jail cell, their bedroom. They were napping. And now they're in here. So, there's one. And the other's right here looking at his lips and whole notch out of palette. I don't know what's going on. So now I'm going to be using my Morphe Glamour Bronze in Leader. This was the best thing I could have did was purchase this bronzer. It's amazing. Just can you get into it? Look at it. I want to take some blush, my Alamar Cosmetics blush trio, and I'm I might mix these two colors. I don't know why. I just like using. All the colors in here. <laughs> Look at it. The boy. I'm going to sweep this powder from down here. You trying to see what I'm doing, Baba? Do you want to see the camera? No. I want me to show you. Look. Aiden. Aiden. Look. told y'all didn't he okay so blush and all that is on so now it's time to move on to highlight i don't believe i put any um of the bronzer on my lower lash line then should i do it now i feel like i should do it now because we're here and i just feel like that's what i should do yeah that does make it look like a little something something extra like I try a little hard or something so I'm gonna spray my face first before I put the highlighter on press all this in oh shit hold on okay, I'm going to put my highlighter on first I'm gonna be using the Maybelline Master Chrome and Mo and Gold yeah I know I haven't used this in a while it's not really my favorite highlight but I have it, it was the first one I found so we're gonna use it don't come in here trying to outshine me on camera it's not bad though. I don't know. No, it wasn't this one that I had a problem with. It was the Molten Rose Gold. That one was kind of toxic. Like, she really didn't show up and do her part in the relationship. And I didn't like that. No, I didn't. I went ahead and did a little switch up for you guys. I took off the footy pajamas. And here we are. My kids are in the back crying. What's good? Um, no, he's not really crying. He's just whining. He's just, he's being a toddler. That's just what toddlers do. But yeah, I'm back. And this is what we're looking like. I feel like you kind of might have saw it before we get off camera. But then again, I don't know. Because I kept going on to focus. And I kept focusing on like my kids. And the stuff that was going on in the back. So I don't really know what you saw. I have no idea. I can't tell you. I didn't watch the video. Didn't watch the footage. Didn't play it back yet. So I don't know. Now he's crying. All right. So let's just jump right out of here then. Like I always tell you guys, I'm your girl Tiffany. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you in my next video.